Hi sir, I'm Rupal from Industrial Outlook. So we are obviously here for 7th edition of Renex and Renex is focusing on net zero emission. So what are your outlook on that? Uh, so we have been participating in Renewex for uh, you say last three years and when we talk about net zero definitely uh, you see all the people here they, we all are working towards carbon to reduce the carbon emission in the in our environment so when we talk about net zero what Invergy is doing we are trying to provide project uh, products which are more energy efficient more uh, the uh, products which are more efficiency supposingly we are also working on some storage projects uh, products which are able to give uh, which are more eff energy efficient products so whereas all other people are working on store uh, only on the on grid products we are we are working on energy storage projects on which we people can get output up to 10 years and uh, better outputs with the invergy products what kind of products that you are working on so Invergy is working with a super cap storage solution. So what super caps is offering, we are offering 10 years solution, energy storage product, product uh, which have a 10 years warranty and maximum charging and discharging uh, current, capacity, current carrying capacity. When we talk about uh, super capacitors, they are not lithium ion based technology, it's a capacitor based technology. You see, to, uh, to, make the, to manufacture the lithium ion products, there is a lot of pollution in the environment as well. There are a lot, uh, lot many mining and uh, many other hazard, environment hazardous products are used for lithium ion. So Invergy is working on super capacitors. Super capacitors are not it's a very easily, it's a graphene based technology. So they are less hazardous to our environment. And yes, we are uh, working very hard to achieve the net zero uh, target mission. Sir, is there any, like, any new trend or challenges or new opportunities that you see for renewable and renewable industry basically? Yeah, definitely there is a new trend into the renewable industry. Earlier, our renewable industry was limited only and only towards the on-grid plants. But now we have seen uh, the government has been banning many DG, uh, gen sets. So the industry is transforming towards storage solution as well. Many people are looking out for the uh, hybrid solution inverters and also for the storage, more uh, storage solution since the government uh, is working towards banning all the uh, uh, DG gen sets and they are also banning the lead acid, usage of lead acid batteries. So the technology has been shifting a lot from the only limited technology of on-grid towards hybrid technology where people need different, different storage solution, uh, storage solution products. Doing business in India, what is the difference that you see doing business in India or internationally? So when we uh, talk about the Indian markets, it's a very sensitive market. Uh, as compared to an international market, people are dependent upon two things. Firstly, firstly the product is the uh, main component of the Indian market. And second, the price, uh, Indian industry is more sensitive towards service and price. So uh, when we talk about Indian industry, three things has to come all in line product, product quality, service and cost effective. So I know when we talk about uh, all these things, it's a very difficult to make them into one single bucket to uh, bring out the best service, best product and uh, best price in one bucket. But we have to, uh, being an Indian in the, to sustain in the Indian market, we have to be, uh, we have to make a product in such a way which can be a pocket friendly product, we can, we can provide uh, better value addition and also provide good services. So that's a major difference between Indian market and international market. International market is a little bit less price sensitive and more quality and uh, product sensitive whereas when we talk about India, here people are a little bit more price sensitive and also human, sen human sensitive. Like when I talk about human sensitive, they want personal attention. They are not dependent upon a structured policy or when we talk about any structure, formal way of communication. They want human uh, interaction and human personal relation as well along with the product. So that's a major difference between. What are your future outlook for renewable in industry? So my future outlook for renewable industry is that definitely renewable industry will be grow now also it will grow at least 10, 10 times more. Ten, it will grow ten, ten folds in the coming uh, years because people have to shift towards sustainable. Uh, now the, what? There's another one gap. Now people want to become energy independent as well. The people of in this country has been understanding that they want to become energy independent. They do, do not want to get uh, be. They do not want to be dependent on some particular product or to the government only. So people are trying to become energy independent. That's why they are shifting for uh, renewable project products and renewable projects so uh, in the coming years uh, renewable industry will definitely grow up to tenfolds thank you sir thank
थैंक यू फॉर योर टाइम